What's going on, everybody? Vince Goodrum here. It is still Sunday afternoon. About to hit the sauna. The reason why I'm making this video is uh, some people have informed me that Frank Tafano has once again put out a video about Mr. Adam Starwitz, his former business partner. They want to know what the great one thinks about it. Well, honestly, I mean, how many times has he gone over uh, Adam Starwitz and attacked him online? You know, I, I was beginning to actually like him. I mean, he puts out, Frank goes and puts out a video on making a good steak sandwich, you know what I mean? Not sandwich, sandwich. And making French fries, although that's a lot of work just to make some freaking French fries, but I'm sure they were quite tasty. And once again, he goes on about Adam Starwitz and how he ripped them off. And, you know, now he's intensified his uh, craziness by wanting to subpoena, uh, you know, all the businesses. You know, nigga, you dumb. You can't go and subpoena any businesses for a civil case. First off, you would have to have a judge sign off on it, which no one's going to sign off with your crazy ass. Just keeping it real and tone it till you like it is here, okay? Number two, all the stuff that you uh, pointed out, you know, so what? He spent $20,000 on a freezer. Did your uh, meat packing business require a freezer? Yes, it certainly did require a freezer, okay? All you've pointed out is so-called and what I would consider business expenses, dry ice, meat, and everything like that. You have still shown no proof that he has physically pocketed into his bank whatsoever, okay? Not only that, if he's your business partner, he doesn't have to ask your permission in order to do business operations and activities here. Okay, and by the way, your paranoia stems to the point to where he gets up and walks around the building while talking on the phone. Everyone freaking does that, okay? That's not suspicious whatsoever, you moron, okay? It's not suspicious, okay? You, you've, you have absolutely, positively no evidence. And, and then you put his wife's name out there, you know? Why, why are you going to go do that for? Just because you're mad at Adam... Uh, doesn't mean you go and got to physically publish her name, okay? I mean, wh what is wrong with you? Uh, please tell me where on the chart where uh, Adam Starwitz touched you, okay? Again, Frank, your, your arguments don't make any bit of freaking sense here, okay? None. And, you know, I, I'm, I'm just going to leave that to the side. What really concerns me is that you still bring up uh, your parents being angry and upset. And guess what? The great one doesn't give a damn about your parents, okay? Nobody cares about your parents. YouTube doesn't care about your parents. Even God doesn't care about your parents, okay? Nobody gives a flying monkey about your parents there, okay? Just hold a French toast about your parents. No one cares about your mammy. No one cares about your pappy, okay? And, you know, you shouldn't actually care, except you still live with your parents, okay? Instead of making a video uh, about Adam Starwitz ripping you off, why don't you make a video uh, entitled, When is Frank Tefano going to move the hell out of his damn parents' house here, Okay. Your parents are angry at you because you still live with them, okay? My mom would be pissed off if I still lived with her, okay? Uh, adults at your age should be living on their own, all right? Period. That's why your parents are really angry at you, because you're bringing all this grief on them, making these outlandish lies and stuff like that. Of course, it's going to be delivered on your doorstep, okay? Okay? And if your parents have any any involvement in the business whatsoever, guess what? They're going to come after them all because of your big mouth. OK, can you not shut up? Can you? Simple. I mean, that's all you got to do. But as far as things are concerned, nobody cares about your parents. OK, not your mammy, not your pappy. All right. 
You need mental help. You need some mental help, you know, don't, I mean, I'm not talking about Dr. Phil. He's not licensed or anything. I'm talking about some real mental help, you know, uh, go to Sally Ford or something. You, you must be on some, some crack. You must've been on the same stuff Ann Hesh was when she drove her Mini Cooper into a house there. That's, that's, that's probably what you own there, boy. But honestly, I, I got to get to the sauna before it closes. And that's all I got to say today, people. Like and subscribe to the Vince Goodrum channel. Peace and soul.